Hey guys, it's Wes, not your normal miner. Today we've got a fun one for you. Today we're going to walk you through the process of setting up an ASRock H110 Pro BTC Plus motherboard. Um, we're going to walk you through setting that up in an open air GPU mining frame um, using an EVGA power supply. Um, we're going to walk you through everything you need to plug in as well as um, everything that you're going to do um, in the BIOS there to set up a um, GPU mining rig. Um, only other thing you'll need to do is figure out if you're going to use a thumb drive um, or if you're going to um, uh, run Windows there. Um, but as you can see, we're going to walk you through the process start to finish. The only other thing you'll need to figure out um, once you start adding GPUs is where you're going to plug those in and how you're going to power them up. We are a cryptocurrency mining based channel focusing on pool testings, overclock setting testings, how to's. Um, we did build our remote garden location specifically meant so we could show you guys everything we did. <laughs> Hi, son. As far as electric updates and, and uh, power updates, uh, heat removal as well, um, here's a picture of that remote garden location. Um, but once again, today we are going to be talking with you about the ASRock H110 Pro BTC Plus motherboard and how we're going to set that up. Um, we do have the uh, quick installation guide that we'll walk you through here as well. Um, we did go ahead and take some notes so you can kind of see we did highlight some different things here. Um, but once again, we're walking you through how to set this up on an open air. Air, GPU mining frame. Um, once you're going to um, add your GPUs and such, you'll need to go from there. Um, but once again, all these things that are highlighted, if you go ahead and power those up on the back of your power supply, you will be set there. Um, we did also highlight them here um, so you guys can see um, the ATX 12 volt. You'll also think that's your uh, uh, PSU um, or CPU, I should say. That's your CPU. Um, and then you got the CPU fan connector, the ATX power connector, SATA power connector, PCIe power connector um, one, and PCI power connector two, as well as the chassis fan connector. Um, so let's go ahead and get started. Here you can see this is our ASRock H110 Pro BTC Plus motherboard. We do have it installed on our open air GPU mining frame. You can also see that EVGA 750 watt um, fully modular power supply. And that's what we're going to power this thing up for. So here we go. We're going to walk you through the process. As you can see, I'm on the back of that power supply. We don't have anything plugged in here. So first thing I like to do is I do like to go ahead ahead and plug in the ATX power supply on our motherboard you can see that right here that is going to go into slot number four and on the back of our EVGA fully modular power supply you can see where that ATX power connector does um, plug in that does have two different connectors right there step two I do like to go to um, on the back of our power supply it's going to say cpu um, on our booklet here it says atx 12 volt um, we go ahead and connect that next that's up there near the um, processor and the processor fan and as you can see that's right there above cpu 2 cpu is what we're plugging in there it's four next thing i like to plug in after that is i do like to go ahead and plug in our sata power connector now you can see that here that is in the lower left hand side of your screen and on our power supply back here you can see i did plug that into sata one next thing that we plugged in is our pcie power connectors and that's power one and two okay i am also going to use this to power up fans auxiliary fans but you do need to hit uh pcie power one and power two Believe me, guys, this is everything that you're going to need to do. This is going to make it super easy setting up your open air GPU mining frames. Here you can see that I did plug that into peripheral one, peripheral one for that PCIe power connectors. All right. Once again, we are using that EVGA fully modular power supply. So when you get that all done, if you power that up and you hook up your monitor, it's going to pop up your BIOS. Here you can see we are using the H110 Pro BTC Plus motherboard. You can see we got that Celeron G3900 with 2.8 gigahertz. Uh, processor speed 2800 megahertz and we've got 8 gigabytes of uh, dual channel uh, DDR4 RAM there. Next screen is going to show you here over in advanced settings, the USB settings. It's going to show you everything that you need. The next screen is going to be our advanced settings ACPI configurations. 
Check that out. It'll have everything you need. Following screen is going to be our advanced chipset configurations. Make sure you pay attention to this because the next screen is the second part of the advanced chipset configuration. And you can set this up to restore if the power goes out when it comes back on for your rig to power back on. That's all the way at the bottom. Check that out. Next thing, we're going to have boot. Make sure you check everything out here and have that all set up correctly. If you've got that set up correctly, that is going to be everything you need to then plug in your thumb drive to run something like Hive OS and, and set it up from there. Um, or you could plug in um, and run Windows. You guys can run that however you want. Then you'd be able to run your um, GPUs from there. Highly recommend setting up one GPU at a time. Today we've been walking you through how to set up the ASRock H110 Pro BTC Plus motherboard from start to finish in an open air GPU mining frame with that EVGA 750 watt fully modular power supply. And like I said, we walked you through from start to finish. If you guys like these kind of videos and you're new to the channel, please hit that uh, subscription. We really cherish that. Um, also, if you guys like this video, hit that thumbs up, comment down below, tell me what you like, tell me what you don't like. But today we've been walking you through how to set up the ASRock H110 Pro BTC Plus motherboard in your open air GPU mining frame with that EVGA 700 150 watt fully modular power supply um, in the description down below you're also going to be able to find us over on twitter um, you can keep up with our latest and greatest and you can also find us over on discord one of the things we've been working on lately is getting our two identical um, test rigs set up for those 1660 evga um, 1660 ti's that we've got so we're gonna have two test rigs there but once again guys today we've been focusing with you guys on the asrock h110 pro btc plus motherboard walking you through from start to finish, setting you up everything you're going to need um, to get that thing powered up and ready for GPUs. Um, comment down below if you didn't like this video, tell me why. Comment down below if you did. If you're new to the channel, please hit that um, subscription bell. We really cherish that. And um, give that thumbs up so everyone else can see this video. My name's Wes. I'm not your normal miner. Thank you.